he's never done anything to Wembley. Mm. But I remember his mm. name was on like a sheet. His picture was on a sheet. Mad. People that were banned. Mad. We were just going to a game. It was like England Croatia or something. I don't know what game it was. Yeah. And his picture was on a sheet saying, so "Don't let this guy in." So how, how did you guys? How did you meet the rest of the guys? Things I know. Obviously, like I guess AJ and Chunk have been making videos for time, right? Like how no, they- no, no. AJ and Chunks worked together in the cinema. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah, they worked together okay. in the cinema. Um, I thought you could find millions of clips of me talking about this same story. Really quickly, I start YouTube. I didn't know who. Um, Never knew chunks, never knew anything. We didn't mm. know each other. I was 19 yeah. years old, just finished college, was trying to play football, didn't make it, whatever. Yeah. Um, I wasn't even a fan of YouTube. I wasn't watching. I was, I'm the only one in the group who has no background of either being a YouTube fan or studying media or anything. Got like, you, got but, you. So I didn't know anything. Then I started randomly in the summer watching YouTube mm-hmm. and I came across Spencer Owen, Spencer FC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As Spencer or the FIFA the player? FIFA player. <laughs> uh, FIFA, so I knew FIFA player, but yeah, yeah. Uh, so originally, so I didn't watch much YouTube, but like, Growing up, I watched a bit of Copa 90, so I knew FIFA player, yeah. I knew KSI, yeah. I knew Joe Weller. Mm-hmm, okay. That was it, because okay. of internet melts. That was it. <laughs> yeah, Literally, that was a good it. series, man. Yeah, that was my college days. That's all I knew, but I, I didn't really watch YouTube. I was playing football, I was focused on football. Yeah. Then I came across Spencer FC. That opened the doors for like a lot of YouTubers, um, for me. And then I was watching Spencer Rowan, watching like, there's a right kid, a few different FIFA series that he was doing, and I loved it, I was hooked. Then he did the first Wembley Cup mm. against you guys. Mm. And when he did the first Wembley Cup, I was like, whoa, like, I just came from playing football. I love football and YouTube are playing at Wembley. Like yeah. this is insane. And, um, but I didn't know who the YouTubers were. Like I knew I have two freestylers. I knew them obviously because yeah. I played football and they were freestylers. I knew KSI. I knew there was a group called Asylum. I didn't know who exactly was in Asylum. I just knew there was KSI and I knew there was one other black guy. That's mm. all I knew. <laughs> yeah. like, that's all I knew, yeah, like yeah. generally, generally. So now obviously then I got really hooked onto YouTube. I was watching like you guys, I was watching everyone, like the whole world opened up for me. And I just said, you know what? My like my my friend who lived like down the road owned a camera, mm, but mm. for photos like he was taking okay, he, yeah, he yeah. took pictures, yeah. And um he was like super creative, so I was like you know I'm just gonna film I want to film a video. So with me and my friend Hasib filmed the FIFA video, mm-hmm. and I got my friend um uh, Lawai to edit the video, and it took like three weeks to edit. <laughs> he doesn't know how to edit. Yeah, I didn't even know what SD card was. So <laughs> so my friend Lawai edited the video, and then it came out. And then um, one time I was just on Twitter, just chilling and whatever. Like I was, I was, I was part of football Twitter. You yeah, know yeah, them yeah. annoying kids? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, one of them yeah, on the football yeah, Twitter. So I was yeah. just promoting it and stuff. Got a couple hundred views. I was gassed. And then um, I have a friend called Ilias from, you know, he was yeah, in Locked yeah. In, yeah. So I didn't know, I've never met him personally, but we followed each other on Twitter because mm. he went to a school near mine. And then he retweeted Chunks' video on my timeline. Okay. Because he knew Chunks. Yeah. So I clicked on Chunks' video and I recognized one guy in Chunks' video. And then I saw that Chunks is Somali guy mm-hmm. around the same age as me at that point. Yeah. Now I realize I'm only two months older than him. <laughs> around the same age. And he knew someone, in, like we knew the same person. And he had one, two videos out on his channel. I had one. Yeah. So I DM'd him. I said, hey bro, is this so-and-so in your video? I slid into his DMs. Um, it was September the 6th, 2015, I remember. Mm-hmm. I slid into his DMs and he was like, yeah, it's this person. How'd you know them? I said, ah, oh, like I knew them from back in the day. Oh, sick. How you started YouTube? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then we're talking on DMs for a bit and then we realized we live 10 minutes away from each other. We're the same age, mad, mad. same background. Yeah. Both just started YouTube. It that was, it was fake, like, it was nuts. Yeah, yeah, it really nuts. Is, yeah. Really so then we linked up, we met up and then we started making a couple of videos together. And then he said, I have a friend called AJ who works at um, Cineworld with me. Mm-hmm. He takes photos. AJ like did media, took photos. Yeah. So there's one time where Joe Weller, do you remember he did like a fire in a car park competition? Yeah. We had to like submit a rap. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so it's yeah. still on YouTube, I think. Me, Chunks, and my friend Jetman did a whole rap oh, at the competition. Man, man, and then man. Chunks goes, oh, my friend AJ can film it for us. And then AJ, uh, I think AJ snicked it. I think AJ said, no, nah, I'm not doing that. Oh, mad, mad. And then, uh, and then, yeah, then obviously the next time AJ started hanging around, like getting involved, he made a channel. And there was me, Chunks, and AJ. I met Nico on Amigo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what? I'm at Nick on Amigo. Okay. There was like, it was like a, remember when it was like, on Amigo you can put keywords. Yeah. yeah. I think there was a YouTuber that put something like, oh, use this keyword and everyone. Yeah. So I was on Amigo and then like, I came across Nick, but it was a black screen. Yeah. So his camera was off and then he saw me and then he started rapping my lyrics from the Joe Weller fan. Nah, man. Man. So I was like, who's this? His first is a fan, like, who's yeah, this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like, he turned his camera on and then um, we traded Twitters and we started yeah. following each other on Twitter. And then we met Nick at Insomnia. Mm, mm. I fifty seven, I fifty six, wherever it was. We went Nico Insomnia, and then he started hanging around with us a lot because he's from Stafford. He's not from London. Okay, yeah. He started hanging around with us a lot. Nico and Kenny knew each other from when they first started YouTube together. Yeah. Um, and the rest is history. Then Nico Sick. started coming to London a lot, and then then obviously we making videos together, and then we moved in together in twenty nineteen. We started Beta Squad, and that's how I met everyone. It's Sick. just it's just fate, I think. Like everything. Just, yeah. That's a way yeah. better story than your your best story. 
Just what, locked in your room playing GTA. Yeah. Well, that's not how we no, met. No, you had a cool story. <laughs> nah, man. Dead. <laughs> right. Yeah, I mean, you and JJ went to school together, right? Yeah, Toby and Josh. Went to Toby and Josh know each other. Yeah, it's still together. boring. Josh man. randomly went on Ethan's stream, like Josh uh, on Josh. Wasn't Ethan like really small yeah, when yeah, you guys yeah. first found him? Yeah. That's so, so Josh, cool. Josh was literally on. I think it was on Josh's birthday. He just randomly went on Twitch, came across Ethan's stream, mad, um, and like said hi. Was he called Bazinga there as well? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. sick. And then yeah, they started talking, and then he brought him into a call to play GTA with us, and then. And the Vic and Harry ones are weird. Yeah. Because Vic just kind of played Wasn't Harry with... already like a YouTube, like yeah, decent, yeah. established YouTuber before yeah. he joined? Josh met him at a kick TV tournament or something okay. like that. Like a FIFA tournament. I was just joking anyway. It's fine. Yeah. You guys no, are it's right. fine. You guys, fine. You guys are decent. And how, then how do you know JJ? I met JJ or... on YouTube, man. I messaged him and said, I love your background. What, what background? Yeah, like a, a YouTube banner. It's oh, like a banner. gold KSI. It's like oh, sick. sick. And then he used to use my music in his background. Oh, okay. So I just met like that. And I met him at Eurogamer. Oh okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, okay. But I, I remember like I remember Nico, right? I remember his old, I used to watch Nico's videos from the the start. The skits. You, 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 yeah, have you seen them? Yeah, of course. They're like they're like weird because they're like really bad. <laughs> yeah. But like there's something about it. I kept watching them. Yeah, it was good. So yeah. you could tell that you must have had like the storytelling and like Always. stuff back then. But yeah. I remember watching. It, I'm like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> yeah, it's a bit creepy, isn't it? Like <laughs> yeah, different characters, like, like dolls and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like weird characters. They had a character called Conscience. Who had a character? Yeah, the old man Jimmy, which like a pervert. <laughs> had like weird characters. I'm like, this this kid's got. You could, he's even going to become a psychopath or a genius. Yeah, but, but that's why like- Fine I'm, line. I like it because he didn't quit, man. Like yeah. imagine if he stopped, because he could have, I'm sure back then he was getting comments that were probably like, what the fuck is this? Oh, but he, he, but he probably, yeah. kept going, man. Mm -hmm. So like- Look at him now. Yeah. What do you guys yeah. think of the biggest Menace series? Mental. I've, only, I've seen you all but it? like two. Okay. I don't think I've seen the, which one did I not see? There, tell, was, I didn't see there it. was Mona Lisa, there was Seen that. I didn't uh, see the golf one. Golf old oh, Rackery one. That yeah. one, yeah. That one that one I was the most nervous for. Because like, what because what they did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah. like, this was yeah, it's quite, it's quite yeah. fun. Yeah. tweeted it, right? And yeah, so I saw it, yeah, tight, like months because this was all filmed like last like, year. Yeah. Last summer. Yeah. So I remember when it, it was on Twitter and everything. But I was like, damn, that's a just Rory McIlroy. Well, I remember seeing that and not knowing who it was. I'm like, that's awful. And <laughs> yeah. I find out who it is, I'm like, oh, it's not that bad. <laughs> you know? Well, that's what everyone speculated because of, yeah. of the voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it was just this. a clip of it. Yeah, right? yeah. And then you could hear his voice mm. in the background. And everyone's like, I swear that's Nico. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But the thing is, though, when you see it on the, the video and you see the story behind it, and you kind of see, like, it, it gets, it's better. You know, it's better. Of course, of course. But, but no. no. He's, but, like, yeah. taking things to a new level, man. Yeah. He kind of. Um, I do think that how long can it last in terms of. Like he's just becoming more and more famous, mm. and yeah. all his pranks involve him going up to people. So like it get it must get to a point where people like he does something and someone goes, "Oh, you're Nico." Oh yeah, for sure. Well, that, that's like the uh, Impossible Jokers, right? They people always say that about them. Impractical. Sorry, Impractical Jokers. Yeah. yeah. Like how do you do this? But they they say like a lot of the time we can't do it. You just you just have to scrap it and move on. Yeah. So I'm probably I'm sure mm. Nico has to do the same, man. Like yeah, and it gets to the point now where there's places he's never pranked. Like, they ban him for no reason. Like right. the Euros. Uh, when I was in England, well, it was at Wembley most of the time. Yeah. He's never done anything to Wembley. Mm, but just, I remember his mm. name was on like a sheet. His picture was on a sheet Mad. of people that were banned. Mad. We were just going to a game. It was like England, Croatia or something. I don't know what game it was. Yeah. And his picture was on a sheet saying, so don't let this guy in. Yeah, Obviously, we eventually got in, but yeah. there's places that oh, are banning him. Actually, I remember that. Right? I remember this. I actually yeah. remember, we were like, why is he not getting in? Yeah, he was posting yeah. stories yeah. and like, there's okay, yeah, places yeah. that were ban that ban yeah. him just because, just in case. Mm. That's got to suck. Yeah. yeah, the videos are worth it. Yeah, yeah. No, the videos yeah. are good. The videos yeah. are good. I mean, like, even the the prime ball one was mad. Yeah, so yeah. I didn't even know. Like, you know, when he, he got uh, um, uh, he had he went through another YouTuber. They had to make an application. Yes, I didn't even know. But I, did I reacted to all of them. Just yeah. like oh, this guy's like sick. Yeah, and the whole concept was amazing. And then yeah. Nico did his video. I was like, I feel like such an idiot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's true. It actually, was, you do feel, bit, yeah, you do yeah. feel that way. Yeah. That one was that one was actually mad. Like how well he got everyone. Yeah. yeah. And then he starts pointing out like, oh, his foot's in this shot. Yeah. And this is this. Like, and I'm like, but it's like with him, it's like everything just works for him. Works yeah. out. Like nothing goes wrong. Yeah. Like, I'm like, this is gonna go wrong. Trust me. And like, oh, this is gonna go wrong. It all just works out. But then it's like when you're that smart as well, a lot of planning goes yeah, into it. Yeah, yeah. Well, I know the amount of times Calux has shot videos of that-esque, you know, and he's yeah. like, it didn't work. I scrapped it, yeah. I scrapped it, I scrapped it, you know? I just say Calux get good, man.